गुड मॉर्निंग चिल्ड्रेन आई होप यू ऑल आर कीपिंग सेफ एट होम वी वी आर गोइंग थ्रू चैप्टर फाइव सेंस ऑर्गेन्स टूडे वी विल गो थ्रू सम मोर एक्स्ट्रा एक्सरसाइजेज टू गेट द कंसेप्ट मोर क्लियर इन अवर माइंड सो वी हैव स्टडीड दे आर फाइव सेंस ऑर्गेन्स नंबर वन सेंस ऑफ साइट दैट इज वी कैन सी डिफरेंट थिंग्स and we use our eyes to see different things we can identify the colors and objects by using our eyes now children we will go through an exercise can you identify this objects and colors by using your eyes picture as you can see is of a face the second one yes it is a color which color yes it is red the third picture shows you a star yes children by seeing we can recognize or we can know different objects and different colors the next picture is of sun you can see sun shining in the sky yes and the next one yes it is which color blue very good and the next one is your favorite item what is it yes it is toffee so children our eyes helps us to see different things now let's move to second sense sense of hearing we can hear different voice with the help of our ears like you can identify the different voice of different members of your family your mama has different voice your father has different voice and your brothers and sisters all have different voice now we can also identify the sounds of different animals by hearing them like when you hear the barking which animal yes it's a dog when you hear the roaring sound which animal yes you can identify it's lion meow which animal yes it's a cat now hiss which animal yes it's a snake moo which animal creates this type of sound yes it is a cow so this way different sounds we can recognize by hearing we can also hear loud music and soft music we can hear the noise at the road with the help of our ears now let's move to our third sense organ that is sense of smell and our nose helps us to smell different things like when you have different food items some of the time you can recognize them only by smelling them like you can ask your mama to arrange different things like a perfume a rose flower neem leaves tulsi leaves butter rotten food or stale food like food which is not fresh one then curd and many other different things which you like now you smell them one by one do you find the same smell in all the food items or different yes you will find all different things okay so this we can do with the help of our nose our nose helps us to smell different types of things with their different smell now our next sense organ is sense of taste and this sense of taste could be done with the help of our tongue so for knowing this we will arrange some different things to find the taste like you eat milk chocolate banana coffee lemon chips paneer chili dark chocolate ice cream one by one taste different things what you will find all the things they have different taste like milk chocolate you will find sweet to taste banana 
यस अगेन इट इज स्वीट कॉफी सम ऑफ यू मे लाइक इट बिटर सम मे नॉट लाइक इट नाउ लेमन हाउ इज इट टू टेस्ट यस इट इज सार नाउ चिप्स इट इज सॉल्टी एंड नेक्स्ट वन इज पनीर चिल्ली फ्रॉम द वर्ड चिल्ली ओनली इट इज क्लियर इट इज स्पाइसी इन टेस्ट एंड डार्क चॉकलेट यस इट मे बी अ लिटिल बिट बिटर टू टेस्ट आइसक्रीम यस इट इज स्वीट इन टेस्ट एंड यू कैन फाइंड सम मोर डिफरेंट आइटम्स एट होम एंड मे टेस्ट इट अप यू विल फाइंड डिफरेंट टेस्ट ऑफ डिफरेंट आइटम्स सम यू मे लाइक सम यू मे डिसक नाउ लेट्स मूव टू अवर लास्ट सेंस ऑर्गेन दैट इज सेंस ऑफ टच विच वी कुड डू विद द हेल्प ऑफ अवर स्किन एन नो whether the water is hot or cold with the help of our hands we can touch and find out now when we take out the food from the refrigerator we can touch and say how is it it is cold now when you touch the cotton how do you feel yes it is soft and soft toys your teddy bear and other uh, play toys yes they are very soft to touch stone when you touch a stone how do you feel yes it is hard to touch when you touch a rabbit those who have as a pet how is it to touch yes it has a very soft fur on its skin now towel your towel how is it when you touch it up you will find it some of you may be having it soft some may be having a little bit rough one and wall if it is painted it may be very smooth and if it is not painted it may be rough okay so by touching you can find out different things whether they are hot or cold or rough or smooth so children i think you might have understood the chapter more clearly these exercises are only for your practice you will not do this one in your copy this is only for practice and now children i would like to inform you that your periodic test will start from 17th of august so start your preparations from today onwards i will let you know more about the test later on until then Take care. Thank you.